huge congratulations, stunning performance. You were very critical of yourself before we left the Premier League last time, but tonight you must be over the moon with that. Yeah, of course I'm over the moon, especially when you put on the display like this. And uh, after last week, I also demand a lot of myself because last week in Germany had a poor performance, but uh, that also makes you a stronger dog player. And you can use that and learn from it. And it's not always that easy, but you need to try to make the most of it. And uh, I put a lot of energy and a lot of time into my game and I'm really glad it's also starting to pay out and uh, if you do games like this, uh, displays like this, that gives you confidence and that's nice but it's history now, I need, I need to look to the future and that's tomorrow. Speaking of the future, is this the important thing because we've seen you play well one night but the next night you've been disappointing so is that the important thing now to back it up? Uh, tomorrow I, I'm probably not going to perform like this but 106 average tomorrow will do. <laughs> and, yeah, of course, of course, I, I, I'm always critical of myself, and because I also know I'm capable of. And uh, mm. of course, I have to do exactly the same tomorrow because what I just said, uh, my game just a minute ago was history, and I need to look to the future. But I know what I'm capable of, and you can see now, hey, it's still there. Uh, of course, uh, there's still work, a lot of work to do, but I feel good. There's more in the tank, but uh, yeah, it's there. Everyone said it's been a poor year for yourself, and by your standards, you'd probably admit it has been. Yeah, it was but, a poor year. But the fact that you're still second in the Premier League table, not firing all, on all cylinders, is that a worry for everyone else? Yeah, exactly. Could you imagine when I'm playing my A game, uh, games like this week after week? Or game <laughs> after game? That would, that would be great, of course, but I'm not in that position at the moment, and I have to try to work myself up towards it. But that takes time, that takes some doing, and it takes some confidence, but... Games like this tonight are really helpful. And also, how much are you looking forward to those final five nights of Premier League action with a thousand fans in Milton Keynes? A thousand fans? Oh, that, yeah. uh, it's good. probably going to be a goosebumps moment, but I first need to make sure I go into that with a, with a good feeling. i still got two games to go here. I feel good. Uh, but there's still a lot of damage to do towards the other players. And uh, uh, I know what I'm capable of. I know what position I'm in. And uh, you have to keep fighting hard. That's really important. Michael, congratulations on the result and performance. Thank you. Uh, congratulations, Michael, on, uh, on the winning performance tonight. Just looking at your body language tonight, you look very different. You look like you've got extra energy. You look, you've got something about you, a bit of an awe about you again. Would I be right in saying that? Yeah, my, my wife, uh, last week, every, every morning, she uh, let me uh, stay in. Instead of wake up for the kids, so probably that helped. No, no, I'm just kidding. No, I'm just kidding. I, I, I don't know what I changed, but from losing games uh, like what I did in Germany, you're gonna be angry at yourself. You're, you're investing more time in yourself, more, more. You're gonna be more angry at yourself because that's what you have to do if you want to perform better. And uh, that takes some doing, but uh, that takes time. But uh, yeah, we we getting there slowly, but. Uh, I, I, I see the, a lot of light on the end of the tunnel. And that's uh, really important. So after Germany, you're admitting that you were very angry with yourself. Yeah, of course. But I, I, how can I be happy with a performance like that? I had a few good games, but overall it was just a poor performance. Uh, things like that, unfortunately, can happen in darts. We, see, we saw with other players before as well. But you, you need to try to, to change that around and try to get energy for it, from it, uh, try to use it uh, in your advantage towards the next game. It's not always easy, but you have to try it. Okay. I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but about I think I saw a stat the other day, this is your worst start to a year for 10 years. Um, big, big incentive yeah, for you. Is that really fair with it in this Corona times? <laughs> I'm only giving you the stats. Of, yeah, um, I, 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 I didn't even know, but I... I I don't think it's really fair, but we see on the end of the year what uh, what what the stats are then, and we see what's going on from there. And if it's still really crap, still didn't want anything, you can you can judge me on that. I'm sure you'll remind me of that. Don't worry. <laughs> thanks, thanks for your time. Cheers, Michael. Michael, congratulations on the win and a fantastic performance. Was that a real message you've sent out tonight that you know don't forget about me? I'm still as dangerous as ever. I, I don't have to send out messages. People uh, will be really naive if they don't know what I'm capable of. And uh, uh, I just need to look to myself and perform 
uh, my game and my way, and then I know what I'm capable of, and I don't have to send out messages because I know uh, they all know what I what, I'm, what I can do and what I'm capable of. So yeah, no. Could this be the night that not only kickstarts your Premier League, but the rest of your season as well? Yeah, I hope so. Uh, in the last patch, I had one good game as well. I had a four night afterwards, so I don't want to put myself in that position again. So I need to make sure I have the, the same preparation tomorrow with the same uh, intense towards the game. And that's really important because uh, I, I'm sick of losing. I'm sick of losing games I, I shouldn't lose. So I have to turn that around. And obviously, you won't be content with anything less than top spot in this Premier League. Do you still feel that that's there for the taking if you can get on a bit of a run? I feel there for the take, but if that's not, I want to win this Premier League. That's the most important. And if I'm top, that's nice. Uh, that's always my goal, of course, because I think if I, if I do well in my next game, I, I can be top anyway. But uh, I want to win this tournament, and uh, it's a really big one. The one that's on my list, I have to tick the box off and uh, move on. Thanks very much, Michael. Well done tonight. Thank you. Um, Michael, it was a superb performance tonight, but do you I can take hear, extra... I can hear. Am I just quiet or can you hear me at all? You, can you talk a little bit louder? Uh, I'm speaking very loud, trust me. Oh. Um, um, it was a superb performance tonight, Michael. Do you take extra confidence from the fact that it was against the players yes, playing well himself? Games like this gives you a lot of confidence and uh, it's not easy to throw on and ten average. Trust me, but uh, I've worked really hard in the past weeks to try to achieve something where you can hold yourself on and get yourself confidence from. And uh, this is one of them games, um, but now it's history. I have to look to the future, and that's tomorrow. You mentioned just a second ago that it's about following it up. Is that the most important thing, not just being a singular performance, following it up and doing it night after night? Uh, yeah, of course. The, the last time I had a really good performance, well, 107 average, and the day after was 92 or something, and that's crap. I'm not allowed. I cannot be happy with things like that, and I wouldn't let it happen tomorrow because I know I'm better than that, and I know how I feel. But I feel better now. So for some reason, I don't know why, but I know there's more and more to get, more to go for, and uh, I feel there's more in the tank. Thank you very much for your time, Michael. You're welcome.